The author platform, something you need as an author, or which is what the advice is given to what writers who want to be, who are inspired to be authors must have. But do you really need one? Do you? Yes, yes you do. There is no question that you need one if you want to sell your books. A more interesting question is, when do you need an author platform? Nailed it. What's my fellow wordsmiths? Tim here. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. I am continuing my talk on the author platform. I started this with my last video where I broke down exactly what an author platform is and its purpose. Link to that video in the cards. I highly recommend you check that out. But a little spoiler. <laughs> Opener. Today's video, we're going to focus on when you need an author platform and more specifically, do you need one before you publish anything? Like and subscribe? Sure. Oh, I'm on Reddit now. Let's get started. This idea that you need a platform before you publish is advice I've seen way too often out there. And it drives from this idea that as your platform is your visibility as an author and your ability to sell books, which is true. And that's not bad advice. It's good advice. It's just timing. If you don't have a book or books to sell, you shouldn't be focusing on that. You should be focusing on writing, not marketing. Telling those who aren't published to start marketing before they're about to, or even close to, or ready to, is absurd. Yes, I know we're gonna have to do marketing. As terrifying as it may sound, if we want to sell our books, we will have to market. Especially if we're going the indie pub route. But even if you go the trad pub route, you're gonna have to do it. Once you're signed, your publisher is going to give you about two bucks for marketing your book. Only huge names like Earth. Brandon Sanderson, Earth. Jonathan Grissom, Earth. Stephen King Earth. get huge marketing budgets. And guess what these authors also do on their own? Say it with me. What I don't get is more experienced authors telling less or new writers to start focusing on their platform well before they need to. Maybe it's because they know it's hard and takes a lot of work to get noticed. Maybe they wish they started sooner. I don't know. But it's stupid. Because these same people who scream, focus on your platform now, are screaming about all these other things you're supposed to be doing now. Like writing, or stop making excuses, and write, all this. It's no. I'm not saying you shouldn't have some kind of online presence. There's this thing called social media. You should have one. But it doesn't mean you need to spend hours on end trying to grow it. Sure, engage with other writers and your target audience. However, it shouldn't be your main focus. I swear, these top authors need to hit the fucking stop pedal on this advice. They act like you're committing career suicide by not launching a full author platform years years before you publish. Like I said, I'm all for for an online presence. But does that mean you need a full author website three, four years before you publish anything? No, no you don't. Look, I'm aware I'm biased on this topic. Simply because working on my author platform was my way to avoid writing when my work in progress was in trouble which you can learn more about by watching this Earth. video. My whole point is to think through this topic. Earth. If you know you don't plan to publish a novel for three, four, five years, sit down and make a plan on how you can best use those years to slowly develop a platform while focusing on what matters, the writing. I swear, these top author tubers hint or even believe you should publish your first novel you ever write, which is a terrible idea which I cover in this Earth. video. Sometimes you just need to write Earth. more than one book. No, no, you need to write more than one book before you're ready to publish. But that's a topic for another day. Focus on what matters. You focus on writing 
and getting good at that. When you've gotten that part down, then start focusing on marketing. You made it to the end of the video, so why not smash that like button and subscribe? Have you ever thought about using a pen name? Click this video, find out if you should, and I'll see you there. Thanks for watching, bye.